So, very recently, Mojang have decided to start blacklisting servers through the use of um, a server-side list of things, which um, is polled at the netty side of things, so they can affect versions from 1.7.2 and upwards. Um, I've actually lost a case, which is kind of annoying. Um, so, um, the Mojang API has these block servers, and most have been cracked. Actually, we can take a look at the list here. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, whatever. The hashes list is a lot less now. So, um, what GitHub user, oh, what I have done, actually, to start, is created a Java agent called uh, Mojang Server Blacklist in order to easily just add something to your launch options and, you know, blacklist it. So what you do here to manually install it, you download, uh, you just go to where your downloads folder is, um, here, and you want to find Mojang Blacklist Bypass here. And what you want to do is um, go to where your dot .minecraft is. So, home. So, you can just put this anywhere, but I like to keep it in the Minecraft folder itself. Because it's got a nice and simple path. So, once you've installed that, you can go to your Minecraft launcher and, um, whatever, <clears throat> in a moment, and whatever profile you're using, doesn't matter, let's do it for Optifine 1.8, or just let's do it for 1.9.4, I guess, and in your JVM options, you just add a new parameter, say Java agent, but colon, and then the path to your Java agent jar, which is the jar here. So, uh, Mojang blacklist bypass dot jar. You have to provide a full path. If it does have spaces, you can wrap it in quotes. And then you just hit save profile and everything's good to go. I would demonstrate this, but I don't know any blocked servers. Um, so that's relatively difficult to do for the layman. It has many steps. So what GitHub user, um, what's he called? Silver Cory has done is created an auto installer called Mojang Please. And all you do is you just, you download it, you run it. Uh, so you download it. You run it, you make sure your launcher is closed, so you hit yeah, and it's really weird, so you have blacklist underscore bypass in your dot minecraft now, and I believe every profile should have the launch argument supplied to it. Like... So, any profile we use, let's say 1.7.10 here, has the... Oh, it completely overrides the JVM arguments for some reason. It doesn't seem like a brilliant thing. I'm gonna open an issue on that now. Um... But yeah. Once you've done this, everything should be fine and dandy, and you can join blocked servers. So, um, in the block, yeah, these are just blocked servers, so I didn't need that. So yeah, that's it.